Growing up, you may have read or watched The Wizard of Oz. This is a story of a girl named Dorothy who was transported out of her home together with her faithful companion, Toto. They are then placed in a very different universe where she encountered witches and wizards with magical powers. She went into a lot of magical troubles in order to come back home. When she finally wakes up to her original realm, she found the resemblance of the characters from her time in Oz to those men she encountered in their farm. It is still ambiguous whether she really underwent the adventures in Oz or whether she just imagined the whole thing. Nevertheless, many people believe that this is one of the first accounts of parallel universe in film. Could this be true in real life? Can we have our other self living and existing in another universe? Could there be another narrative of our life in another universe? That sounds pretty strange. Not to mention, scary. The theory of multiple or parallel universes has been a talk about by many people nowadays. But some scientists still dismiss the theory as fiction, despite evidences of these alternate universes. What exactly are parallel universes? Can they affect the way we live our lives? These and much more will be answered as we traverse the possible explanations the scientists have found as proof for the existence of parallel universes. The idea of parallel universes dates back to 1954 when Hugh Everett III, a young Princeton University doctoral candidate, came up with a radical idea that parallel universe exists exactly like our universe. These universes are related to ours. They branch off from ours and our universes branch off of them. According to Everett, within these parallel universes, our wars may have had different results than what we have known. Other extinct species may have had evolved and adapted in other universes. While many people doubted this radical idea of Everett, it came to be known that Everett attempted to answer some questions raised in the growing field of quantum physics. Quantum physics is the study of the behavior of matter and energy at the molecular, atomic, nuclear, and even smaller microscopic levels. Since scientists discovered in the early 20th century that the laws governing macroscopic objects do not function the same in such small realms, scientists believe that there are other scientific laws at work that we do not know yet. Scientists studying quantum mechanics soon realized that quantum particles such as photons seem to take different forms. Incidentally, physicists studying quantum level observed that photons can act as particles as well as waves. They even noticed that even a single photon exhibits shape-shifting properties. Putting it in a human experience, you as a person can look and act like a solid human being when a friend glances at you. In a matter of seconds, when your friend looks back at you for the last time, you have already taken a gaseous form. A form of a ghost, maybe. This phenomenon has come to be known as the Heisenberg Uncertainty Principle. Physicist Werner Heisenberg suggested that we affect the behavior of specific matter just by observing it and its quantum matter. Hence, we can never be fully certain of the nature of a quantum object or its attributes, like velocity, and location. It isn't weird enough. Another physicist named Niles Bohr supported the Heisenberg uncertainty principle through his Copenhagen interpretation, stating that all quantum particles do not exist in one state or the other. Instead, he theorized that quantum particles exist in all of its possible states at once. Bohr's interpretation has been widely accepted by the quantum community until Everett's many worlds theory get the attention of many scientists. While Everett agreed with the idea of superposition and the notion of wave functions, Everett suggested that observing quantum matter causes an actual split in the universe rather than switching between states. So the universe literally duplicates and splits into multiple parallel universes for each possible state of quantum matter. However, many worlds theory posits uncomfortable implications. 
Suppose you encountered an accident that miraculously spared your life. Many worlds theories suggest that you could have died in another universe. Everett's approach was also believed to be controversial because it conflicts with our fundamental understanding of the concepts of time. Still, many scientists conducted experiments that seem to prove the theory. However, many worlds theory is not the only one to explain the universe. String theory claims that there exist particles even smaller than quantum matter. This theory states that the essential building blocks of all matter and all the physical forces in the universe exist on a sub-quantum level. These tiny building blocks resemble tiny rubber bands or strings that make up quantum particles. Different kinds of matter are created by the strings depending on their vibrations. This composition then takes place across 11 separate dimensions. String theory says that gravity can flow between these parallel universes. When these universes interact, a big bang, like the one that created our universe, occurs. As we have known, it began some 13.8 billion years ago in the Big Bang where the universe was hot, dense filled with matter and radiation and was expanding, cooling, and gravitating from the initial state. Since we can't go back to the early times, we can just look into the observations that the hot Big Bang was preceded and set up by a period of cosmic inflation, which stretched the universe's curvature. This gave the universe the same energy density with quantum fluctuations, which occurred during inflation superimposed atop the uniform energy background. As inflation goes on, there's a possibility that the field will roll into the valley where inflation ends, or a possibility that inflation will continue, or even a possibility that the field will roll in the wrong direction, taking us farther away from inflation's end. As the inflation continues, it stretches the universe and creates new space in some places. This results the creation of hot Big Bangs in those regions what we might call the universe. In between those universes is more inflating space, where inflation continues to grow so new space gets created as the universe expands in other places. As the process continues, we get a multiverse, one where independent separate universes are constantly being born born forever, separated from one another by space, that continues to inflate eternally while new universes and new hot Big Bangs continue to brood. However, these universes are not casually connected, so there is no possibility of transferring anything between the universes. Yet many experiments have been done about the matter and scientists found high energy particles coming from outer space, some of which are a million times more powerful than anything we can generate ourselves. Low energy particles known as neutrinos can pass completely through the earth, barely interacting with the substance of our planet. But higher energy objects are halted by the solid matter of the earth. This means that high energy particles can only be detected coming down from outer space. But heavier particles coming up out of the earth means that these particles are actually traveling backward in time. This suggests the evidence of a parallel universe. Yet many argue that the existence of parallel universes can be detected if we find evidences of collisions of universes. Most likely, they believe that such collisions could leave cold spots or hot spots on the cosmic microwave background or CMB. Gravitational waves, which are ripples in the fabric of space-time, are also believed to provide evidence to support the theory of cosmic inflation. This theory predicts that the gravitational waves left over from the Big Bang could put tiny curls into the CMB. If researchers can spot such curls in the CMB, it could ultimately boost support the idea of an alternate universe. There is a well connection between parallel universes and two other mysterious and scary space phenomena, the black holes and white holes. Black holes are terrifying objects in deep space that swallow everything that comes near them. They are formed when giant stars collapse on themselves creating very dense masses that have gravitational forces. White holes are the opposite of black holes because they push out everything inside them. That means nothing can go inside. 
every white hole then could generate other big bangs generating multiple universes inside our own or outside its radius or boundaries hence the laws of physics there would be different reality could even be made from antimatter time would it be positive and undirectional too or these universes would be the mirrors to our universe but with divergent timelines based on different quantum states confirming the presence of parallel universes depicted mostly in the works of fiction let us know what you think about these parallel universes could there be two dorothy's and two different universes could this be even true in real life could there be another you in an alternate universe? Could these explanations and discoveries be enough to make us believe parallel universes exist? Thanks for watching and don't forget to like this video and subscribe.